Phillips webcam and I've removed the focusing ring off of the front of it. Just take a screwdriver underneath it and it pops right off. And we're going to put this focusing room inside of this tube. And then we're going to put this tube over the Phillips webcam. Now, one problem I found is that this webcam will go out of focus really easily. So I've, in, I've put a couple of drops of glue. Um, actually, it's uh, it's the uh, the heat stick type glue, wax or whatever you want to call it, to keep it in place. So once I got my focus ring adjusted here, and I know I know it's got really good focus, then I put a couple of little tiny drops over on the side to hold that focus in place. Now, what we're going to do, what I'm going to do is drop, is drop this down inside. I've made a hole all the way through. And I'm going to drop it down inside and then let it come out the other end. Okay, you want the three little legs to stick out. Now once the three little legs are stuck out, then you can get a, a glue gun, which is what I've got over here. I've got a glue gun and then I'm going to glue that into place and I will be back. I don't know if you can see or not but I've got it. The focusing cap is now back in there and it's back on the webcam just like it was when it came off. Now all you do is take it over to the telescope and you slide it right on to the eyepiece or the polar scope eyepiece And then you plug in your USB into your PC and you should be able by using uh, software webcam software you should be able to to find uh, Polaris without having to get out of your little easy chair hope you enjoyed this <laughs>